ready for the dictation. Three, two, one, start. This is an appeal under section 19 of the Family Court Act against decree directing payment of maintenance at the rate of rupees 500 per month by the appellant stop appellant comma despite approach comma is not maintaining her or permitting her to reside in the family house stop on the other hand appellant has deposited compensation amount of rupees 10000 in his name depriving the widow plaintiff from the same stop therefore comma she is residing with her brother at kanpur stop in this circumstance direction should be given to defendant for granting maintenance to her stop case of defendant is that marriage of his deceased son with plaintiff is void under hindu marriage act and as such he has no obligation to maintain her stop because plaintiff is residing with her parents and is being maintained by them for which he has no obligation to maintain her stop para in order to give direction to father-in-law to discharge obligation stop family court is required to give clear finding that the daughter-in-law plaintiff is unable to maintain herself out of her own earnings or other properly or comma where she has no property of her own she is unable to obtain maintenance from the e estate of her husband or her father or mother and father-in-law has means to discharge obligation from any co property in his possession out of which plaintiff daughter-in-law has not obtained any share stop on perusal of the judgment we find that trial court has not considered the requirements of section 19 to be satisfied for putting the obligation on defendant father-in-law to maintain the plaintiff daughter-in-law stop order is comma therefore comma vulnerable stop para vulnerable duty of the family court under section 9 of the family courts act for making endeavor to conciliation between the parties comma does not appear to have been discharged in this case stop if at all such conciliation failed the family court ought to have given a clear finding to that effect in the judgment itself especially when order of the family court is subject matter of appeal in this court stop this is more necessary because lawyers are not permitted to appear in the family court stop therefore comma the responsibility of the family court is heavy which ought not to be discharged like civil court only stop other provisions should have been complied with stop para in view of the aforesaid discussions comma we set aside the order of the family court and direct the suit to be heard by it afresh in the light of the observations made above and in the light of the provisions of law stop we make it clear that nicety of the rules of pleading should not be insisted upon comma as the parties are not represented by lawyers stop both parties are directed to appear before the family court on 24 10 1994 stop on which date the trial court shall fix date for conciliation and on failure of such conciliation proceed to her the suit giving opportunity to both the parties to adduce their documentary and oral evidence stop since the matter is old one comma we direct the family court to dispose of the suit before ensuing christmas holidays of 1994 stop thank you kya chahiye badle mein hame bas ek pyara like this video ko like kar dena aur subscribe kar do subscribe subscribe channel